Yo guys, how is everyone doing? Welcome back to our Spurs career mode here on FIFA 22. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day and a happy new year guys. I really hope 2022 is a good year for you all. Whether you had a good 2021 or a bad one, I hope 2022 is a much better year for everyone. So today we have two league matches at home to Man United and then away at Everton. Last couple of episodes have been incredible. We've got four wins in all competitions, starting with the Bournemouth game in the league, 2-0 win. We knocked Newcastle out of the Carabao Cup. We humiliated Crystal Palace on their own turf, beating them by eight goals to one. What a result that was. And then we won our second group game in the Champions League against Young Boys by two goals to nil. So hopefully we can keep that winning run going. So we do welcome Manchester United to the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium. Let's see if we can make it three Premier League wins in a row. Sancho on the ball for Man United. Brilliant play from the winger. What a tackle, but the attack is not over. Fernandez, loads of space here for Varane. Sancho again, and thankfully it's a good save from the keeper. 15 minutes gone, and so far this match has been all Man United. They've dominated possession, but thankfully it remains goalless. Kessie on the ball, Harry Kane, now in Dombele. Left-hand side is Bergwijn, Richarlison into Harry Kane. Now in Dombele to his right-hand side is Lucas Mora. Brilliant save from David De Gea. I think I should have gone to the opposite corner across the goalkeeper. And I think that could have been 1-0 if I did. Right, corner kick. Lucas Mora with it to that near post. Is it going to fall to a white shirt? It doesn't. Fernandez does clear it away, but the attack is not over. Now Romero to his left-hand side is Sanchez. Richarlison, Harry Kane. Now in Dombele. Very good save again from the Spaniard. And it's another corner. Can we open the scoring from this set piece? Harry Kane can't quite connect with it. And the attack is over. Very, very good last 10 minutes or so from us. It was a good opening 15 minutes from Man United, but yeah, last 10 minutes we've been very, very good. And should have opened the scoring, to be honest. But here Man United come on the move forward, looking to make the score 1-0. Sancho puts in a cross, and we are going to deal with it very, very easily. Very good header there from Eric Dyer. Now Rich Arlison, Harry Kane, Hoiberg. Right-hand side is Lucas Mora, and it's a brilliant first touch. And here the winger comes. Can he open the scoring? Mora, what a save again from David De Gea. Wow. I really thought that was going to be 1-0. Somehow he's kept it out. Another corner for Spurs. And it's a decent delivery to that near post. Does get cleared away. Gets cleared further away from Luis Alberto, but we do win it back immediately. Last 15 minutes, we've been very, very good. The much better side, so let's hope we can create more chances and eventually score the first goal in this match. Hoiberg on the ball. Right-hand side is Lucas Mora and Dombele. Lucas Mora again. Can we find Harry Kane at the far post? Keeper catches. Ten minutes left to play of the first half and it does remain goalless. And Man United are going to keep possession. Lovely header there from Ronaldo into Pogba. And here he is back in possession. Now Alex Tellez. Forward to Marcus Rashford. Pogba. Luis Alberto. He's got Sancho on that right-hand side but he doesn't use him. And he loses the ball. Should have just played it out to Sancho on that right-hand side. Right, Romero forward to Lucas Mora, and it's a fantastic pass. And Alex Tellez, I don't think, is going to keep up with the winger here. And it's good play from Lucas Mora and Dombele. Now Kessie, low and hard, fantastic save again 
from David De Gea to keep the score at 0-0. What a strike. Full stretch. How has he saved it? Oh my lord. Right, we get another corner. Can we finally make the score 1-0? Rich Arlison, somehow it's stayed out. How? I think David De Gea made the save. It came off the player on the line. And then the outfield player got something on it to get it a little bit further away. What a header from Rich Arlison. Unfortunately, too close to the keeper. But still very good reactions. Yeah, it hits Wambazaka. And then, yeah, not a great clearance because David De Gea got in his way. And somehow it remains goalless. How the hell haven't we scored in this game, especially from that chance there? Hoiberg on the ball. Now Kessie. Right-hand side is Lucas Mora. Rich Arlison. Lucas Mora again. Can we find Harry Kane? Fantastic delivery. It's not Harry Kane. It's gone to Ndombele at the far post. Spurs 1, Man United nil. What a header from the midfielder. I was trying to find Harry Kane. But it's gone to that far post to Ndombele. And it's a brilliant finish. Back across David De Gea to that far corner. Lovely header. And Ndombele has his second Premier League goal this season. He's doing much better for us in that num number 10 role than Isco and Deli Ali. Ali has done nothing in the Premier League in five matches. No goals, no assists. Isco, I believe, has played five games as well. One goal, one assist. And Ndombele so far, this is his fourth game, I believe, in the league. Two goals, one assist. So, yeah, Deli Ali had a very good preseason, but done nothing in competitive games so far. So, I'm not quite sure what to do still. I think I might get rid of Deli Ali, to be honest. Or do we just see how they do up until January? I think that's probably the best thing to do. And why is Lloris not coming out for that? It's a corner kick. Just under an hour played, our Man United going to make the score 1-1. It's a decent delivery. Good first touch there from Sancho and he plays it forward to Marcus Rashford. across into Ronaldo and it's a lethal finish from the Portuguese international and it's all square at 1-1. With half hour left to play. Was Rashford not offside? Oh, he's not. Lucas Mora at the top. Look, playing him onside. He would have been if Lucas Mora was out a little bit more. And in line with the rest of the players. Just didn't get out quick enough from being on the post. Oh, how frustrating. All right, it's all square. 30 minutes left to play. I think I will make a few subs the next time the ball goes dead. This is a fantastic run from Bergwijn. Can we find a white shirt in the box or cross into Rich Arlison? Oh, goes for the overhead kick or scissor kick, sorry. But unfortunately, not a great finish. Just didn't connect properly with it, did he? All right, let's make a few subs. Who's not having a good game here against Man United? Harry Kane, 6.9. Rich Arlison, 7.0. Bergwijn, 6.9. I think we'll bring Harry Kane and Bergwijn off for Carrasco and Son. Luis Alberto on the ball for Man United. Pogba, now Cristiano Ronaldo. Very good tackle, but the attack is not over. Luis Alberto, Fernandez, Ronaldo, Luis Alberto, now Fernandez, and it's a lovely finish. Man United take the lead for the first time here in London. It's 2 1 with just over 10 minutes left to play. Very, very nice and quick football. Look at this. Just can't defend against this. Impossible. One-touch play is just impossible to defend against. 
and it's a brilliant finish. Right, we trail for the first time here against Man United. We have 10 minutes left to try and salvage something out of this match. Pogba on the ball for Man United. Now Marcus Rashford, Ronaldo, Bruno Fernandes, Pogba, four to Rashford, Ronaldo. Now Luis Alberto, Ronaldo again, and thankfully Romero intercepts, and the attack is over. Right, here we go. This is going to be the last chance to get something out of this match. Son, lovely pass into Hoiberg. Decent first touch from the midfielder. Hoiberg! Oh, it's gone wide. And we've lost. That was the chance to get a point. Oh, my God. That was it. That was the chance to make it 2-2. And not lose. Oh, man. But we do win it back immediately. Rich Arlison to his right-hand side is Isco, and it gets blocked. Please, ref, don't blow. Decent header into Kessie. Left-hand side is Carrasco. Rich Arlison, Carrasco, back into Rich Arlison. Back of the net, 2-2. We've scored in the 96th minute. Oh, my God, what an end to the game. The referee should have blown for full time. But he kept the game going and it's a lovely goal. Rich Arlison has got us a point at the death. Oh, I can't believe it. And there's the full time whistle. It finally goes in the 96th minute. Only three minutes were added on. Wow. What an end to this game against Man United. It's finished all square at 2-2. And to be honest, a point is probably a fair result. Maybe we could have got all three. But I'm very, very happy with not losing this match. Every point counts. Full-time result here in London. Spurs 2, Manchester United 2. Romero on the ball, four to Lucas Moura, now Harry Kane, and it's very good play from the striker to keep possession away from the Everton man, what a run from the striker, out to Bergwijn on this left hand side, now Richarlison, Kessie, four to Ndombele, now Harry Kane, and it's beautifully done, bottom corner 1-0, what a goal that was, we've taken the lead after 11 minutes at Goodison Park, Lovely pass from Ndombele, just laid it off to Harry Kane, who had no one in front of him. The Everton defence was nowhere to be seen when Harry Kane received possession. Completely split open. And Harry Kane has just scored his fourth Premier League goal of the season. Everton nil, Spurs one. Bustos. Four to James Rodriguez, and it's a very good tackle from Lucas Moore, and somehow we kept possession in. Didn't go out for a throw-in. 16 minutes played, and it's been a brilliant start to the game from us. Can we go up the other end and double our lead? Rich Arlison, Harry Kane, back into Rich Arlison. Can he make the score 2-0 against his former side? No, he can't. It's a very good save from Jordan Pickford. Ah, just too close to the keeper. Brilliant save. And we get the first corner of the game, and it's a fantastic delivery. What a header from Eric Dyer. 18 minutes played. We've doubled our lead. What a start from us here at Goodison Park. 
brilliant delivery from Lucas Mora. And it's a superb header from the centre back. Too much power on it for Pickford. And it's 2 0. Ducore on the ball for Everton. Now Gilfie for to Raul Jimenez and his fantastic play from the striker who chips it over the goalkeeper and it's gone in. Everton are back in this game. It's 2-1. Raul Jimenez got away from me so easily. Look at this. And it's a very good finish. Game back on. 23 minutes played and there's been three goals. Townsend on this right-hand side for Everton. Plays it backwards to Doherty. Townsend. Now Gilfie. And it's very good play from the midfielder. Now Decore. Gilfie again. Brilliant turn around. Sanchez, what a save. And we do header it away. And it's going to fall to Bergwijn. And we do keep possession. We are going to get it away. Wow. Lucas Mora is making a forward run and we are going to try and find him and it's a beautiful pass from Hoiberg and here Lucas Mora comes on the move forward. What a run. Lucas Mora with the effort and it's very good defending from Godfrey. 33 minutes played and we have another corner. We scored our second from a set piece. Can we score our third? We almost can. Hits the woodwork. Rich Arlison with the second effort. And it falls into the arms of Pickford and the attack is over. Oh man, that was so close to being 3-1. And to be honest, it should have been Harry Kane should have scored that header. But here they come on the move forward. Are they going to make it 2-2? Two -two? Townsend, top corner and it's all square. After 37 minutes, what a finish from Andros Townsend. Kessie on the ball, Harry Kane. Now Ndombele, Hoiberg, Harry Kane, Richarlison, back into Kane, and it's a good tackle. And the attack is over. Five minutes left to play of the first half, and I can't believe it's all square. We were in full control of this match at 2-0. I thought we were going to run away with it, to be honest. But Everton scored two goals themselves. And got right back in it. And thankfully, Bergwijn does win that header. Very good play from the winger. Now Richarlison, Harry Kane, Richarlison, Kane. Back into Richarlison. Can he score against his former side? Yes, he can. What a finish. 44 minutes played. We've taken the lead once again. Everton 2, Spurs 3. And Richarlison has another Premier League goal. Brilliant play between the two strikers. And bang, what a finish that is on his weaker foot. And Rich Arlison now has seven league goals in eight matches. Starting to find the form he had last season, which is definitely what we need to climb the table. And hopefully we can remain in the lead until the half-time whistle goes. Decore, Allen, Decore again, for to Raul Jimenez, Townsend, Jimenez, fantastic save, and there should be the full time, full time I wish, half time whistle, and we lead by three goals to two at the break, what an opening half, Hoiberg on the ball, right hand side is Lucas Mora, now Harry Kane, and Dombele, Kane, and Dombele again, forward to Richarlison. Very good save from Pickford, and it remains 3-2 after an hour. And we get the first corner of the second half. Can we take the lead by two goals again? It falls here to Harry Kane, now Richarlison. And I think it was a block, not a save, but the attack is not over. Romero, now Carrasco. Oh, it's gone wide. Oh, that was almost a beauty. And what a way that would have been to get your first goal for Spurs. Oh, I don't know if you just heard that little click. That was my finger. 
Remains 3-2 with just under 30 minutes left to play. And they're bringing off James Rodriguez for Alex Awobi. Fresh legs for the home side. Is that going to make a difference and get them back in this game again? Townsend on the ball for Everton. Now Raul Jimenez. Good play from the striker to keep possession. Townsend, Jimenez, forward to Gilfi. 3-3 with 25 minutes left to play. That was a very good finish from the Everton number 10. And they've drawn level again. Nice play from Everton and Gilfie has got too much space. No one close to him. And he tucks it past the goalkeeper into the bottom corner. And after 65 minutes, we have a six-goal thriller. Bustos on the ball for Everton. Now Gilfie, Awobi, Raul Jimenez. Decore to his right hand side is Townsend. Now Raul Jimenez, and it's a very good tackle, but they do keep the ball. Raul Jimenez forward to Gilfeet. Raul Jimenez. Now Decore, fantastic save. And the attack is over. It remains 3 3 with 20 minutes left to play. I think I'm going to make my last sub in a minute. We're going to bring Son on for Harry Kane. Here he is in possession, Kane, Richarlison, and it's decent play here from the striker. Can we take the lead once again? No, we can't. It's a very good tackle, but the attack is not over. Carrasco does pick up the loose ball. Now Harry Kane into Richarlison, and the shot gets blocked, and it gets cleared away. It's not a great clearance, and that's a lovely header from Kessie. Forward to Isco. Now Richarlison! Oh my God, how has Pickford kept that out? That should be 4-3. What a save. Raul Jimenez on the ball for Everton. Forward to Andros Townsend. And it's a very good tackle from Romero. Right-hand side is Lucas Mora. Just under 10 minutes left to play. Can we take the lead once again? Isco, Richarlison, Son. Back into Richarlison. Can he make it two goals here against Everton? Yes, he can. Another brilliant finish from the striker. Everton 3, Spurs 4. What a game this has been. We lead once again. Oh my god. I just hope we can remain in the lead until the full-time whistle goes. And Rich Arlison is now on a hat-trick against his former side. Allen on the ball for Everton. Raul Jimenez, now Gilfi. Allen again, forward to Alex Awobi. It's a decent run here from the winger. Left-hand side is Andros Townsend. Seconds left, the player crossing Alex Awobi with the finish, and it's 4-4. Four, four. Oh my God, I couldn't even stay in the lead for under 10 minutes. How frustrating. We made it 4-3 just under 10 minutes ago and I couldn't even remain in the lead until the full-time whistle. Both defences have been so bad in this game. And the full-time whistle is going to go straight away. We were 2-0 up. They clawed back to 2-2. We took a 3-2 lead. They made it 3-3. We took the lead again. And they clawed it back to 4-4. I just couldn't keep them out. And stay ahead for very long. Which is so frustrating. We should have won this game. We should have won this match. But it's finished Everton 4, Spurs 4 here at Goodison Park. So after two dramatic draws in today's episode, we are now in 8th place on 12 points. 
Wolves are now the league leaders and are the only unbeaten side in the league. What a start they have had. Chelsea are in second, Arsenal third and Man United complete the top four. The bottom three are Fulham, Bournemouth and Crystal Palace. They've conceded 22 goals. Eight of those were against us. In the next episode, we start with our third group game in the Champions League against Marseille, away from home, and then we're at home to Chelsea in the league. So that is going to wrap up today's video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to see you in the next one. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Have an amazing day. Peace.